Creighton, was this a surprise? Um, not really. Um, this is sort of been, Verizon been preparing the market for this for a while, and 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 has a series of a kind of a history of uh, CEOs coming out after a certain number of time, a certain age. So um, we knew this was coming. There had been a winnowing down process over the years. A couple of executives have left because they were no longer <laughs> considered to be in the running, and it really was going to come down to uh, Hans Vestberg or uh, or John Stratton at Verizon. Can we take away anything about Verizon's strategic direction from who they chose? You know, I think we can. Um, Hans Vestberg, uh, of course, came from Ericsson um, and uh, has a background in network technology. A lot of people have been wondering if Verizon's going to do like AT&T did and try to buy a media company. And of course, they've had their dabblings mm -hmm. in media, but Hans Vestberg is a network guy. So I think the money is on him really focusing on getting Verizon to 5G, um, you know, kind of, you know, uh, improving the network quality and staying ahead of the game there, and not so much on trying to become the next Disney or Time Warner. Um, but he could surprise us. Well, I like that you said that because, uh, especially with ZTE that we saw yesterday, uh, it feels like that's their game. Like that's what China wants to do: be the biggest supplier of a 5G network. Um, what's it going to be like to develop that here in the U.S.? Like, where are the competitors going to match up? Well, you know, it's 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 a tough game because in the U.S., of course, there have been the, these restrictions on companies like ZTE and mm -hmm. Huawei uh, supplying network equipment. Verizon doesn't use them, um, and so it has to rely on the European manufacturers. And there's been a lot of pressure on. Verizon to maintain that, um, but of course it's more expensive. The Chinese have uh, very, very good pricing for, net, pricing for network equipment. So that's going to be one of the challenges Hans Vestberg is going to have to face is continuing to keep costs down while he, while he expands this network at a rapid pace um, and, and brings the quality up uh, to where it needs to be to offer true 5G uh, uh, wireless uh, connectivity.